too sick to stand trial. That's the latest argument from the former owner of the KFMB stations, who's involved in a huge college admissions bribery scandal. Elizabeth Kimmel was arrested on the same day as dozens of other parents across the country in a federal bust called Operation Varsity Blues. But as News 8's Steve Price reports, Kimmel's lawyer is now asking that the charges against her be dismissed for health concerns. Elizabeth Kimmel was arrested and now faces federal charges for allegedly participating in a major college bribery scandal. But now her attorney says the charges against her should be dismissed. He says her arrest was so aggressive that it was detrimental to her health. And now she's too sick to go to trial. Kimmel was arrested during a pre-dawn raid back in March of 2019. New pictures show federal agents as they approached her front door. According to court documents, quote, this show of brute force succeeded in overwhelming Mrs. Kimmel, a 54-year-old, 96-pound woman with a long history of coronary problems and no criminal history. She began to suffer chest pains and eventually ended up hospitalized in a cardiac intensive care unit. It's a Hail Mary. Uh, I, I don't think there's, there's a lot of chance that it's going to be, um, be granted. Charles LaBella was a federal prosecutor for more than two decades, and while he understands why Kimmel's attorney is making the argument, he doubts it will work. You know, they make a, a colorable case about, um, you know, her condition, but the fact is that um, a lot of people have medical conditions and a lot of people are arrested. Kimmel, who used to own KFMB stations, is accused of paying nearly half a million dollars to get her two children into Georgetown and USC by using fake athletic profiles. She's pleaded not guilty to all charges. Her arrest was part of a bigger bust called Operation Varsity Blues. More than 30 parents were charged, including actresses Lori Laughlin and Felicity Huffman, who already pleaded guilty and served their sentences. There's not very many question marks about these cases anymore because the testimony, the sworn testimony is all out there in the other trials. Kimmel had open heart surgery in 2008 and continues to live with ongoing coronary issues. The court documents say her aggressive arrest made the situation worse and her condition remains perilous. As a result, her attorney argues she's not strong enough to testify in her own defense, violating her constitutional rights. He goes on to say the only appropriate remedy is dismissal of the indictment. Dismissal is not the only option, and, and it's the most extreme option. LaBella says a judge may grant Kimmel some accommodations due to her health, but seriously doubts any judge would dismiss the case. Kimmel's trial is currently scheduled for September. Steve Price, News 8.